Hi, I'm Dr. John Chisar, the President and CEO of the GBMC Healthcare System, and I'm giving you our weekly update regarding COVID-19, both in the state of Maryland and at GBMC. If you've been watching my updates over the past few weeks, I've been hopeful about the lack of a true surge of cases. I'm happy to report once again that that has continued. The number of COVID-19 patients that are sick enough to make it into Maryland hospitals has remained more or less flat over the past six days. Unfortunately, I'm not yet able to tell you that the number is actually going down. At GBMC right now, we have 23 patients in the hospital who are COVID-19, and we only have five persons under investigation. You may recognize that that number five is relatively low and is lower than it has been, and that is because we are now able to do testing for the coronavirus much more rapidly. You've also heard a lot over the past couple of weeks about antibody testing. There are now over 150 commercial kits out there for antibody testing. None of them have been approved by the Food and Drug Administration, and only four of them have extraordinary use approval of that agency. We are a bit reluctant to do antibody testing because we don't yet know what levels of antibody truly show that patients are now immune to COVID-19 and couldn't get sick again. In addition, we're not 100% sure that patients with antibody titers therefore showing that they have antibody to COVID-19 are not still infective. So I don't think people should be rushing out to get antibody testing. There may be specific indications. So speak with your doctor if you think you are a candidate for antibody testing. Antibody testing will have a big role uh, in the surveillance of the population to determine how many Marylanders are still susceptible to COVID-19. But this is a public health task and not a diagnostic task at the bedside of an individual patient. Today begins Nurses Week. We celebrate our nurses for one week out of every year. 2020, was deemed the year of the nurse by the World Health Organization before they knew that COVID-19 was going to strike. So we have another special reason to thank our wonderful nurses in 2020. We also remember Florence Nightingale, the nurse who played a key role in early knowledge about infection prevention. How fitting. So a shout out to all the GBMC nurses, whether they be in our hospital, in Gilchrist, or in our physician practices. Thank you so much for everything you do. So to all my colleagues out there in the community, you are safe at GBMC. If you need us, call your physician. He or she may set up a telehealth visit with you. If you are sick enough to require immediate help, please come to the emergency department. Do not be afraid. You are safe at GBMC. Thank you, wash your hands, keep social distancing, and we'll speak with you again soon.